Now, NBC5 First Warning Weather, the area's certified most accurate forecast. Not a bad start at all, especially for this Monday morning because we got sunshine, right? Yes, lots of sun all the way through the afternoon and some rain on the way in the middle part of the week. We could still use the rain. We're in like that. <laughs> use the rain. <laughs> yeah, I mean, because you know, rain kind of brings yeah. the mood down, but mm -hmm. uh, it's been dry recently. Mm -hmm. Had a little bit over the weekend, but not enough to really uh, bring things back to say where they were several weeks ago. We'll be in the 60s this afternoon though. No rain in the forecast, lots of sunshine and a breeze out of the north about 5 to 10 miles per hour. On the temperature trend map, you can see the warmest day of the week is actually tomorrow. We get close to 80 in the Champlain Valley and then a cool down in store Wednesday into Thursday. That's the cold front which brings the rain in. We'll have the hourly timeline on Futurecast in just a second, but you'll see that we moderate quickly enough for the weekend. We're likely in the 70s for Memorial Day weekend, but that may not be a totally dry forecast either. We'll explain in just a bit, but here's the sky over Jay Peak blue this morning. A lot less smoky than we had yesterday, and even though there will be some wildfire smoke aloft, shouldn't be as thick as uh, what it was on Sunday. 42 at Jay Peak, cold front coming through this morning. It has already passed through the northern half of the area, and it's working its way south of Rutland and Lebanon now. You can see this on the temperature map with some 40s and 30s to the north, but a few spots close to 50 down to the south. That front will come through, but it's a dry frontal passage. You won't have to worry about any rain today. Maybe a few extra clouds across southern Vermont, but that is just about it. Now for tomorrow, more clouds overall, but still plenty of sunshine mixing in close to 80, and there may be one or two showers in central Vermont, just enough instability in the atmosphere to perhaps pop something up over the terrain. That should be the exception and not the rule. Now here's what happens on Wednesday. Morning is dry, no issues. Even through about lunchtime, we're okay. But in northern New York, the clouds will start to thicken up. And then here comes the front in the afternoon and evening. There may be a rumble of thunder ahead of the front itself, but the steadier rain looks to be here in the evening through the early half of the overnight. Now, unfortunately, the Lake Monsters home opener is at 635 PM on Wednesday at Centennial Field. And if that forecast holds, they may be dealing with some rain, so we'll be fine tuning that as we move along. Here's a quick look ahead at Memorial Day weekend. It's not a slam dunk dry forecast, but it doesn't look like a washout either. So we're going to be in that awkward in between stage where there may be some showers, but it could turn out dry. Just have a plan ready for anything outside in case it does trend wetter, but seasonable temperatures look likely. That is most of us staying in the 70s. 70s and 60s for the next five days, a busy week too. We have the Lake Monsters on Wednesday, Vermont Green kicking off on Friday. Of course, the Vermont City Marathon less than a week away on Sunday. Right now it's dry, but we'll keep a close eye on that forecast. Back to you.